Hey guys, we're back for more Let's Play Knights of the Old Republic. So last time we learned a lot about the Sith Code, and now we're going to explore the rest of the Sith Academy. Uh, there are several people we can talk to. This one's interesting. His name is Kel. Oh, uh, My hello. My and Kel. I don't remember seeing you here before. My name is Kel. Kel Alguin. Is something wrong? I... oh, uh, nothing. Are you sure? Yes, my master always says I'm too trusting, too willing to show weakness. You're a Sith, so I, I really shouldn't, you know. I can't persuade you to tell me? Uh, no. No, I, I really can't. A, a Sith, like you, would use any means to succeed. Are you saying you're not a Sith? Well, I, 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 I didn't mean it like that. Well, how'd you mean it then? I, I shouldn't trust you. I, I can't trust you. Can I? Out with it. This is getting tiresome. I, um, yeah, forget I said anything. Just go back to your training, please. I have work to do. You're no Sith. I've never seen anyone so pathetic. I, I am too a Sith. I'm more a Sith than you are. I'll show you. Okay, now he's gonna fight us. Like the dumbass he is. Too bad it's not gonna work out for him. Alright, finish the touches, there we go. Now the cool thing is, if you come here before Dantooine is destroyed, which is destroyed after you get the uh, fourth star map, I guess, um, before you go to the last star map, and if you do that and come here in your light side, you can convince Kel to abandon being a Sith and go back to being a Jedi. And if that happens, you can go back to Dantooine and you'll be training in the Academy, which is pretty cool. I like that touch. And I think this is where, if we did Karth's character side quest, this would be where it was. It's all about his son and his son's joining the Sith Academy and then convince him not to. All that bullshit. But okay, let's move on. We have more people to talk to. There's Meikle. It's a bad year to try and become a Sith, you know. I've got it all wrapped up. Um, I remember you. Meikle, right? That's right. You might as well just go home, you know. There can only be one Sith this year, and that's me. What makes you so sure? You think I would tell you? Have my brain started dribbling out of my nose or something? It would be an improvement. <laughs> Funny. Say that after I'm a full Sith and I'll ground your face into the dirt just for fun. Yeah, I'm sure you will. Can I get a hint or something? You hanging around still? Don't you have your own plans? Not that they'll help you. I'm in for sure, you know. Okay, it would make you so sure. At least give me a hint. I could, but what would be the point in that? See you around, chump. Alright, failure. How awesome. Well, there's still... I think there's somebody over here. No, there's nobody here. Maybe this is where Dustal... Or the... didn't say his name before. Karth's son is named Dustal. So maybe he's there. He's in the academy in one of these little... areas. Room areas. But here's Lasho. You? I remember you from the colony. I can't believe you actually made it into the academy. Who are you? My name is Lasho. Remember it, for I'll be the one who earns the prestige to move on. You'll have to be satisfied with next year, I suppose. You're trying to become a Sith as well. Just figure that out, did you? <laughs> It just so happens that I have a surefire way of pulling ahead in this little contest of ours. You don't really have a chance. And what way is that? I found an artifact that will impress Uthar far more than anything you could ever scrounge up. I'll win for sure. Why haven't you brought it to Uthar yet? I don't have it just yet. I'll get it when I'm good and ready. Or when you can. I mean, you haven't gotten it because you suck. It's guarded, isn't it? So what if it is? I'll get it eventually, regardless. Nothing good comes without a bit of a fight. That's the Sith motto, more or less. 
Um, I don't think that's the Sith motto. Maybe I could help you get it. Hmm. I suppose I could use some help. The artifact I know of certainly won't be easy to take. But why should I work with you? Uh, I've always wanted to work with a beautiful woman. Flattery, is it? I suppose it's possible that Master Uthar could award both of us prestige. We'd be ahead of the others, for sure. Unfortunately, the Holocron lies in the gullet of a Tukata mother. I can arrange for us to meet her, but you're going to have to help me in putting her down. That makes sense to you? Go into the valley when you're prepared enough. I'll be amongst the central pillars near the north end. Okay, why do you think this holocron is so important? Because it probably contains secrets from the time when the Sith ruins on this planet first existed. You don't think that Master Uthar would find that impressive? And I'm just supposed to trust you? And I'm just supposed to trust you? You're the one who has to work on this, remember? You watch me, and I'll watch you. I don't trust you any more than you trust me. If you don't like that, don't come. Okay, see you there. Remember, the central pillar's in the valley. I'll be waiting, so don't take too long. Whatever, Lasho. I'll take as long as I want. And last but not least, well, maybe it is least, we have Chardin, or Chardin, however you say it. I remember you. You're all right. Trying for the Academy, I see. Who are you? The name's Chardin. Didn't I tell you that back in the colony? Maybe not. Do you want to coordinate strategy? I don't work or play well with others. Thanks for the offer, though. All right, let's see what happens when we challenge to a duel. I remember you. I challenge you to a duel. You want to challenge me to a duel? <laughs> I've got a lot more planned than giving someone like you a fair fight. I guess we'll meet eventually on my terms. Good luck until then. Uh huh. Nice foreshadowing, Shardan. Okay, so that is everybody's room area in the Sith Academy, so we need to head out into the main part, which is right here. There's Uthar, that's who we need to go to to uh, get prestige from, and that is a door that doesn't open. I um, can't remember if we can... Oh, we can do something over here. Well, wait, that's the wrong way! Way to go. There is a way <clears throat> that I completely just forgot about and actually just remembered that I can get prestige from. So hopefully I can not screw it up. I think it's this way, the interrogation room. So let's talk to the Sith and Okay. Maybe you can do better than I. This Mandalorian is proving more resistant than I expected. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to get him to tell us where his weapon cache is hidden. So far, all the serum combinations I'm using are proving ineffective. If I bring his drug threshold too high, he'll go into shock and be useless. Too low, and he just refuses to talk. It's been maddening. How do you drug him? Just activate the console. It gives you a variety of options for serum dosage. The right amount applied at the right rate should do it. The real trick is that the only way to gauge your progress is to watch the prisoner closely for his reaction. Our scanners can't pick up his vitals. You want me to try it? Certainly. Uh, just don't kill him or send him into shock. He's supposed to be questioned not executed. If you manage to get the location of his cash out of him, I'll be sure to pass on the good word to Master Yutha. Okay, great. So, do we talk to... I wasn't really listening. I, was, I wasn't paying attention. Uh, do we talk to the Sith at Dome, or... No. We go to the computer panel. <laughs> Okay, can you speak Galactic Basic? Okay, 
Tell me where the weapon cache is. All right. Activate the serum console. So um, I think I know how to do this. Um, let's inject high dosage. Okay, he's not cracking yet. Let's do it again. Let's do a... Um, let's do a small dose of truth serum. Still nothing. So I think one more small dosage should, should do it. Alright, tell me where the weapon cache is. Alright, so we did it! We got the information. Yes, I heard that. Excellent job. Thank you for locating the cache. Naturally, I would see rewarded, but I would prefer that everyone believe that I extracted the information. What? Are you joking? Of course not. Information extraction is my specialty. I'm not about to let it be known that someone wealth did my job better. You had some fun, didn't you? Now run along, and let's not turn this into anything unpleasant. Okay, I'm not letting you get away with this. Of course not. Oh, I suppose one would need to be alive to go running to Master Yuthba to report the location of the cache, wouldn't they? Does that mean that you're ready to battle a true Sith? Shall we make an issue of it? That's right, let's go. Ha! Gather your anger then, and let us see who is superior. Alright, this isn't hard. You have made a mistake, interrogator. So yeah, that interrogation, um... I think how it works is... Each dose has a certain amount of... A certain number of points it's worth. And you want a total of nine. And so... The high dosage, or whatever it was called, was worth five. <clears throat> the medium was worth three, and the, the small dosage was worth two. And you want a total of nine. Nine makes him spill the information about the weapon cache. So one high dosage is five plus two small dosage is four, so that's nine total. So there are other ways to do it, other combinations, but. That's how it works. Wow, that doesn't look very good. I think they took the interrogating a little bit too far there. Okay, how do we get a green crystal? Not gonna use it though. Let's go into the dueling room. What's in here? Well, you look weak. I think I can beat you. You're just sitting back and having your if fun. If you're here to use the dueling room, go ahead. I'm through with it for the moment. Um, I challenge you to a duel. No, thanks. I'm pretty much right now. Maybe later. What kind of dueling are you talking about? This is where you get to hone your killing styles. We get sent captives all the time to practice on. It's very. You mean we can kill any of the prisoners here? You only get so many before the terminal cuts you off. Some of the students are a little bloodthirsty and get carried away. What do I need to do? Just go to the computer console and open up one of the cages. And don't be wasted. We only get so many captives a month. Okay, thanks. No problem. Alright, so as far as I know, this you can't really get any prestige from this. I guess you can get some experience, but uh, I'm not really going to worry about it. So let's just get this metal box and be on our way. So this is the dueling room. So we've seen the torture... Or not the torture room. The interrogation room, which I guess is pretty much a torture room. And the dueling room. What else is there here? Um, can I go out this way? What is this? Oh, that's back to... okay. So the only place left to go now is out into the um, 
Valley of the Dark Lord. I'm not going to talk to Master Uthar yet. I'm going to wait until I have more prestige and I can talk to him all at once. And yeah. But, wait a second. I'm going to talk to somebody here. Uh, who are you? My name is Adrenus. I am the Chamberlain of the Academy. I generally look after the maintenance and supply here. Um, how come you don't speak Galactic Basic? Galactic Basic is the language of the Republic, but I come from a world beyond the edges of Republic space. There, the Twi'lek language of interstellar trade and commerce is the most common dialect. I can speak your language, but my accent is still very pronounced. Some of at the Academy would mock me for this. And I'm not eager to become the subject of ridicule. There are many humans who come from worlds beyond Republic space. We seem to be more sympathetic to the Sith cause. Some of them are even training at the Academy, unlike me. So you aren't a Sith? No, not truly. I serve the Sith, but I do not study and train the forces you do. Okay. Questions? Alright. Did I ask who he was? Yeah, I did. Okay. Maybe it's not him I talked to. Um, you know what? Screw it. Let's go out into the valley. There's something I could do, but I want to go ahead and head out into the valley to take care of this. And I'll do the rest later. So, first thing we could do here in the Valley of the Dark Lords is there's a cave right around the corner over here that I think we will go ahead and take care of. Although we might have to wait until the next part. Alright, so... Get rid of these. Shouldn't take very long. Oh, there are four of them. Let's see, we're at 17 minutes. Hmm. You know what? I'm just going to end this part here. Next time, we'll head into the cave and most likely finish it. The Shyrat Caves. So I'll see you guys then. Thanks for watching.